Prime Minister Mohamed Roble has fired Foreign Minister Mohamed Abdurizak. Roble replaced him with Abdi Saeed Muse Ali. The Prime Minister attended the launch of My Bank Saturday after the cabinet reshuffled. While at the event, he urged Somali businesses to contribute to drought relief. He has stated no reason for the sacking of Abdurizak. The former foreign minister didn't see the move coming, and he posted his reaction online. The story of my replacement is a surprise to me as much as everyone else, but follows my offer of resignation a week ago. I will update everyone in due course, but it has been a pleasure to serve the Somali nation and, of course, wish my replacement all the best. Just before he was replaced, Abdurizak had posted a message celebrating his one-year anniversary on the job. It was a year ago today when I was appointed as FM. It has been an honor and a privilege to serve my people. Thanks to our hardworking and dedicated diplomats, our voice can be heard and we're represented well internationally. His replacement was formerly President Mohamed Formajo's national security advisor, a job now filled by former spy chief Fahad Yassin. Reports indicate Muz Ali has been out of the country for most of the past year. He received some praise from supporters for his elevation to the nation's top diplomatic post. Mohamed Abdi Hassan Pecos was named the deputy foreign minister. As part of the cabinet shuffle, Roble also swapped two ministers. Mohammed Aden Malim will now run the plant and animal husbandry ministry. Hussein Mohammed Sheikh Hussein will now be the minister of public works, housing and reconstruction. Neither Formaggio nor Villa Somalia has released any statement reacting to the moves. The president was seen honoring educators on Somali Teachers Day on Sunday. There have actually been four foreign ministers during Formaggio's term as president. He fired then Foreign Minister Ahmed Issey Awad for the wording of a public statement on Ethiopia. Muz Ali takes his post at a time when Somalia's relations with Amazon and Kenya have been strained. ADN TV will continue to report on political developments in Somalia.